so I'm doing my makeup collection video and I'm starting with my face pop face products um, so this is my covergirl clean oil control foundation in 505 ivory this is my covergirl true blend pressed powder in translucent fair um, this is my NYX concealer in a jar in fair I think, yeah, fair. Um, I have this bronzing beads that I got from Mary Kay a long time ago that I don't really use because I don't really use blush or bronzer, um, but I have it, so I thought I'd show it. And this is my Mary Kay translucent powder. This is, oops, I didn't mean to show her address. Um, probably have to cut that out of the video but whatever and this is the brush I use to apply my powder I do have a kabuki brush but I don't like it very much it's not very soft this is really soft so yeah now I'm going to move on to eyeliners I have this big thing of eyeliners which is out of focus but I'll bring things into focus in a minute so I have an elf cream eyeliner and this is just a black one and then I have another e.l.f. cream eyeliner. This one's copper. Um, I used to have wet and wild ones and I loved them until I started having allergic reactions to them. So I switched to the e.l.f. ones and they do not have a staying power of the wet and wild ones. So if you don't have sensitive eyes, I would go with the wet and wild ones because these ones do travel under your eyes. And then I have a Maybelline Eye Studio one. This is just brown. And I like these. I did not like the black one though. It wasn't very opaque. Neither is this one, but I don't mind building it a bit. But with my black liners, I like them to be really black. And then I have a couple of the Milani Shadow Eyes pencils. I have the one in purple and one in the, the champagne color, and I love these. These do not budge. They're great eyeshadow bases. Um, they're really pretty. Um, Make sure you blend them out in the first couple seconds though, because they do set very fast. And then I just have a... Ooh, it's coming on the screw in just a second. I gotta shut the camera down. I have this MAC pigment sample in pink opal, which I haven't used in a while, but it's really pretty. And I have an Aveda um, eye accent in Uruku. Or, no, Acacia. Um, I have a couple of NYX Jumbo Eyeshadow Pencils. Cottage Cheese and Lavender. Don't like these that much. They really crease a lot. So, um, I did give away Black Bean and Milk in a Swap with someone. And, <laughs> to be honest, I really don't like them because they crease a lot. I know people love the Milk ones. But I don't. <laughs> They have my mascara, um, Maybelline Lash Discovery. I love this. It doesn't really um, lengthen much, and I have really long eyelashes, so I don't need it. And every time I use a lengthening mascara, I end up with spidery looking eyelashes, which I do not like. So I like this. It thickens a bit, but it doesn't lengthen, which is nice for me. Next, I have my NYX HD Eye High Definition Eyeshadow Base which I, I love. I really love it. It works great. Um, works as great as any of the higher end stuff, so I definitely recommend it. Then I have this e.l.f. Shimmering Facial Whip, which I really haven't used much. It's... I don't know. And I have this Avon pencil and I can't even read it because yeah Avon big color eye pencil please excuse any noise in the background we have guests and I have a lot of family members out there so they're making noise I just have some more random pencils um, really style style things and I don't know if they even make these anymore. Um, 
just don't really use them because they're really a pain to sharpen. Um, let me get all my wet and wild pencils out here so I can show you. It's a Jordana one. Do not get Jordana pencils like this. They are very, very hard. They do not glide on at all. They are horrible. I don't know about the twist up ones. Those might be nice, but these pencil ones, they are horrible. So let's see get my wet and wild ones. Because let me tell you, I love my wet and wild pencils. Now they're not long wearing or anything. But I love the colors. I love how they glide on. And I love um if I can find it. It might be in here. Where's my brow pencil? I don't know where I put my brown pencil. Whatever. So yeah, these are some wet and wild pencils. Um, I have a white, I have a charcoal, I have a brown, I have a green, I have another green because I accidentally bought two. Oh wait, no. Those are two different greens, okay. And then a purple. And I do have another one somewhere that I use for my eyebrows. I cannot seem to locate it at the moment. It was in here in this bag. There it is. This is the eyebrow pencil and taupe. And I love this. It has wax in it so it makes your eyebrows stay nice. And then I have a mix of blue eyeliner, which I forgot I had but I really like it, and it's great for a base for a bright look. And then I just have some more random pencils, nothing really special. I have a couple of the Beauty eyeliners from Sally's. These are nice. They glide on really well. I don't know about their wearing power because I don't really pay attention, but they are nice pencils. Um, so those are my eye pencils. And I... That's all for the eyes and my most used products, and I will be back with eyeshadows and lipsticks later.